Hi guys, if you are facing this problem, problem with wireless adapter or access point, okay, while troubleshooting you get this error, then uh, I'll surely help you out. First of all, the first fix which most of the uh, people facing this problem should try out and that is turning off your router and then turning on it back again. That means restarting your router, okay. Just turn off your computer, turn off your router, then turn on your router again and then turn on your PC again. This is the first fix and if this does not fix the problem. The second fix which you should try is that search CMD in the Windows 10 search box, right click on it, click on run as administrator. Now once this opens up, you have to run these commands, five commands, one by one, okay. I am pasted, I have pasted these commands in the description of the video given below. You can directly copy from there. These are standard commands, nothing to worry about. This reset the network, okay. This uh, releases the IP configs, okay. So, so let's. Okay, so after running these four commands, just try again and your problem will get fixed. If it does not solve your problem, the one more thing which you can do is to just search services and now click on services to open service manager window and now here you have to search for IP helper service. Okay, just double click on it and just stop it. Okay, just stop it and choose startup type as disabled. Okay, now click on apply and click on OK. Okay, then this also solves your problem. If this also does not solve your problem, one more thing which you can do is to search device manager and now click on device manager to open it and now just make sure that this uh, a driver name which ends with wireless adapter okay this is usually the wi-fi adapter is not disabled okay just right click and choose enable if it is disabled okay for example like this okay or one more thing you can do uh, to be sure just right click and enable every you know uh, thing which is visible in the network adapter sections okay to make sure that you have enabled the actual wireless adapter okay if this so does not fixes your problem the last thing which you can do just right click on your wireless adapter which ends with wireless adapter under the network adapter sections and now click on update adapter now search automatically for driver okay now it will automatically search for the latest version of the driver and it will install it for you. So this was the last step. So thanks guys. Please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the Geek page.